actually, uh, we don't live off the gut microbiome. They don't live off us, we live off them. And so it's good healthy bacteria that is in or uh, in our in our gut that really uh, can, who um, that, that that really keeps our gut healthy. Ninety percent of our hormones are metabolized in the gut, and a lot mm -hmm. of times people end up with having having leaky gut syndrome, the digestive issues, mood issues. A lot of our health is tied to good gut health, and conventional medicine now has really focused has now begun to focus on the importance the super importance of having a good, healthy gut, increasing that gut microbiome. There's so many things that we could, that could cause inflammation within the gut, and we don't know, and we're eating this on a daily basis, and you're wondering, okay, I diet, I exercise. You know, you try to do all the things that everyone says, and nothing works. And it's because we are so inflamed. The food that we are eating, the environment, there's so much inflammation that's going on in the gut. And if you really, you know, have a good gut health analysis to see so you could take away all these things from the gut, you will see so much different, so much difference in your gut health. You start sleeping better, you start looking better, you start, you know, feeling lighter, and the scale changes. 